Hey, what is up guys, Sumlip here, and I'm back with another video. So guys, you may have heard of the word ping. Now guys, ping is often used and you may be wondering what exactly it is. So guys, one place where ping is often used and can often be seen is actually on internet speed tests. So over here on speedtest.net, uh, you can see <clears throat> the first thing that it actually tests is your ping speed. So currently mine is 13 milliseconds. Now guys, what exactly does ping mean and um, how is it important? Okay, so guys, first of all, let's start off with what exactly is ping? Guys, what ping is, ping can be thought of as basically when your, uh, let's say your computer sends a request to another computer, right? It sends a signal to another computer. Now, <clears throat> when it throws that signal to that computer, and that computer uh, brings that signal, uh, you know, throws another signal back to the computer. The amount of time that takes is actually called ping. And um, yeah, guys, that is uh, basically what ping is. It's basically the amount of time that it takes from a signal or some type of thing to go from your computer to another computer and then back to you. So <clears throat> where exactly can ping be uh, seen being used? So ping is actually used everywhere. You know, wherever I am, let's say even on YouTube, let's say I click one of the options over here. So let's say I click that. Now, when I click that, my computer is sending a request to some YouTube server somewhere in the world, and then that server is sending back a request to go and, you know, change the thing from videos to home. Now, guys, that is actually affected by my ping. The amount of time it actually takes for that signal to go all the way uh, to that server and come back is actually um, affected by my ping speed. And, um, guys, where is ping exactly important? So, guys, as you can see, in a place like YouTube, your ping speed doesn't really matter too much. For instance, I have a ping speed of 13 milliseconds, and even if I had a speed of, let's say, 80 milliseconds for my ping, then it doesn't really matter too much, because in YouTube, you really are usually, you don't, you're not dependent that much on how much time it takes to go from one tab to another, or when you click on a video, how much time it takes, uh, for that video to actually, you know, go, um, and when you click on the video, how much time it takes for the video to actually pop up. That amount of time isn't too important. But one place where ping definitely is important and really um, does matter is in online video gaming. Now guys, you may have heard of lag or latency. And guys, that is really affected by your ping speed. Now, why is ping so important in uh, online video games? Well, it is pretty simple. So think of a shooting game. So guys, in a shooting game, um, when you hit your mouse, let's say, to fire, and um, basically the amount of time it takes from your mouse to uh, from you clicking on your mouse to the uh, to you actually firing the bullet in the game is actually affected by your ping speed. So let's say you had a really slow ping. Let's say maybe uh, 200 milliseconds. So guys, the problem would be that when you hit your mouse, um, then it wouldn't instantly go and fire. It would take maybe, again, like 200 milliseconds or whatever to actually go and fire. So in that much time that it actually takes to go and fire, someone who has a much faster ping than you or someone else can actually go and kill you. And that is basically what um, a lot of times lag can be seen as. Um, you actually hitting a, a control button and the thing actually reacting in the game so that that is often affected by your ping speed so guys um, it is often as you see affected in online gaming not only in shooting games but even in something like racing games if you for instance are racing and you um, you know hit the button to go left or something at a really sharp turn and it doesn't react instantly you can go and crash into an object or Something like that can happen. That's why ping is really important in online gaming. Okay guys, <clears throat> so now that we know what exactly ping is, let's look at some factors that can actually affect your ping speed. Okay, so guys, the first factor, as you can see over here, is the bandwidth of your internet connection. So this basically means um, you know, which actual um, ISP you're using, what plan you have, stuff like that, the actual bandwidth 
bandwidth of your internet connection definitely is a big factor. Then another thing is what applications or possibly users that are using that bandwidth on your local network are. <clears throat> so what that basically means is that how many people are actually trying to use that ping speed. So obviously if there are more people trying to use that same internet then it's obviously going to have, uh, there's obviously going to be a higher ping speed. That means a slower actual connection. Then again, the contention ratio um, can also affect it. The contention ratio means basically how many, uh, it's basically the ratio to how many people are actually using it, uh, using your bandwidth or using that internet connection to the number of actual requests that are being made. So obviously the less uh, actual um, people that are on that server are using that uh, thing or using that um, product, the less the actual lag or latency is. Then the distance from the actual server. Now this is really important because let's say that you are gaming somewhere in let's say the US, but the server is actually located in Russia, like halfway around the world, right? So it's going to take much more time for your actual connection, for your actual, you know, request to go all the way to uh, Russia and then come back to the U.S. So that your distance actually matters a lot. Then again, you know, if the ISP is actually throttling, uh, throttling or slowing down your ping speed, that can also affect your actual ping speed. And then lastly, the load of the server that you're connecting to. This basically means that, you know, if there are a lot of requests being made to that same server, that you know what exactly the server is, how much the server can handle, things like that actually can also affect the ping speed. Okay guys, so that is really about it for what exactly is ping. Hopefully you guys now know what ping is, um, how it is important, where it can be seen, and also what type of things can actually affect your ping speed. Okay guys, that is about it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If this video helped you, please hit that like button and please subscribe to my channel for more such videos. That is about it and I will see you in the next video. Until then, peace.